Hey, what's up, fam? Welcome to day 56 of Run the Year 2021. Having a blast. We just finished a little trail run back that way. And so uh, now we're doing our cool down walk. But I wanted to continue this from yesterday uh, where we had, uh, we were talking about um, plantar fasciitis. If you've had it, if you have it, and you're using the ball to roll your foot on it and it's not working, uh, one of the things could be just simply checking upstream of the injury, upstream, downstream of the injury. So uh, uh, a couple of days ago, we talked about um, the calves being, your calves being tight. I showed you a couple of stretches. Um, if, if you haven't seen those, go ahead and check out the video now, right here. Um, yesterday, we talked about uh, your hips. The, um, uh, your hips being kind of being weak. Um, and, and being able to strengthen those because that can have a, a play on it because again, if your hips are out of line or weak, um, they're, they're obviously they're not going to provide the stability you need for your feet when they hit the ground and that's what's causing those that uh, your plantar, your, your fascia, that's what's causing that to work harder, right? So, and then the last thing we want to talk about today is your, uh, your lower back, your lower to upper back, that thoracic extension, right? Um, and so again, if you haven't seen the first video about stretching the calves, go ahead and check that out. Yesterday I posted a video for um, you know helping helping those helping those hips. So if you haven't seen that, go ahead and check that out right there. And then check this one out, which is really about uh, being able to basically being able to turn right. Because when we walk, I mean I'm over exaggerating, but when you when we walk, we have to be able to turn left to right, right? And uh, in order to get full turn, you gotta have thoracic extension. You gotta be standing up straight. You gotta have good posture, right? You can't be hunched over and try to get full uh, turn. So um, here's an exercise that you can do. And as you can see there, you know, you start, you wanna be fully stretched out. You can grab a broom handle. I'm using a PVC pipe um, and, and use that to turn. Right, and the big thing here is as you turn and when you get over on your uh, on your back, you want to make sure that your body is fairly straight. You want that thoracic extension, right? You don't want to be hunched over. And so, so do that a couple of times. Um, and again, all these exercises exercises you want to do a couple of times a week, if not even a day, a couple of times a day for for the next couple of weeks until you until you can really get loose, to really loosen up those joints. And then uh, see if that helps. It helped me a lot, I can tell you. Um, you know, doing a lot of running, doing a lot of working out. Um, hey, my, my ankles my, my ankles get tight, my calves stay tight. So I'm always stretching those out. So again, um, just something to help. If you got something out of it, hey, hit that, hit that like button down below. And uh, to all our viewers and subscribers, if this is your first time here, hey, we welcome you. This channel is all about positivity. It's all about promoting, uh, getting out and moving your body. And uh, that's the big thing, um, is to keep moving, right? Because uh, we're not getting any any younger. And uh, as you move, you, you realize that it's kind of easy to stay, kind of easy to stay loose as long as you keep moving. So, so with that, that's all I got. Um, hey, invest in yourself, invest in your health. And uh, also, if you got something out of this, go ahead and hit that like button right there. Okay, we'll talk to you tomorrow.